It's important to be aware of what repairs and maintenance fall under the product's warranty and which repairs or maintenance are part of the product's normal wear and tear. Let's review the product's routine maintenance recommendations. Remember that the environment will determine how frequently filter maintenance is required. So check filters before and after each use to determine if filters need to be emptied, cleaned, or replaced. ProTeam recommends that you keep a filter maintenance log, which will enable you to keep track of filter replacement. First, let's review ProTeam's filter maintenance. Prior to every use, check the intercept micro filter and micro cloth filters. A clogged and dirty filter restricts airflow and results in reduced suction and overheating. Prevent possible damage to the motor by simply changing or cleaning the filters frequently. Again, remember that the environment will determine how frequently filter maintenance is required. To maintain these filters, first take off the top cap. Pull out both the intercept micro filter and the micro cloth filter at the same time to avoid tearing the intercept micro filter, especially if filters are very full. When emptying the intercept micro filter, carefully remove the filter from the vacuum body. Turn the intercept micro filter upside down into a garbage receptacle that has a plastic liner. Take the garbage receptacle liner and close around the filter opening so that dirt and debris do not float into the air. Gently shake the filter into the garbage receptacle liner until empty. Make sure the pores of the intercept microfilter are not clogged. Fine dust can clog the filter even when it has been shaken out. If the filter is clogged, discard and use a clean intercept microfilter. Non-reusable filters need to be discarded when full and replaced with a clean, genuine protein replacement filter. Check both filters for rips or tears and remember to replace filters as often as necessary. Once a month, or as necessary, hand or machine wash the micro cloth filter and let it air dry. Do not put it in the dryer. Once a week, or as necessary, clean the dome filter. To access the dome filter, first remove the intercept micro filter and cloth filter. Reach into the vacuum body and pull the top piece of the dome filter off and remove the foam media. Shake it out, rinse it, and let it air dry thoroughly. Once dry, replace and firmly snap the top piece of the dome filter into place. Next, reinstall the micro cloth filter. Make sure the lip of the filter completely covers the rim of the vacuum. Never use the intercept micro filter without the micro cloth filter, as the rubber gasket of the micro cloth filter provides the vacuum seal. Next, install the intercept micro filter inside the micro cloth filter. Replace the top cap, ensuring it is closed snugly. Once every two weeks, or as necessary, inspect the HEPA filters. When the filter becomes discolored, replace it with a new one. For best results, this filter should be replaced at least every six months. To inspect or replace the HEPA filter, depress the raised portion of the tab on the filter door. Then pivot the door away from the vacuum body. Grasp the plastic housing on the HEPA filter and remove from the vacuum. To replace the filter door, align the two tabs to the housing, press in place, and then rotate upward. Be sure to snap the locking tabs of the spring finger behind the tab on the housing. You should hear an audible click if installed correctly. The body can be wiped down with a wet sponge or cloth, however you must be careful not to get water on the motor. While vacuuming, stop every two hours or as needed to check, empty, or replace the micro filters. Remember to only use genuine protein replacement filters to ensure optimal performance. Please refer to the limited warranty section of your product's owner's manual for detailed warranty information.